Hey y'all, what's up? It's your girl, Comedic Comedian Prophetess, and I'm back with another video. If you're new to my channel, I'm a prophetic tarot reader, all right? I don't read cards based off the meanings. I read cards based off what Spirit tells me, the holy angels and the divine, also a psychic medium, okay? If you're returning, welcome back. I know you're probably tired of the intro, but welcome back, all right? <laughs> Anyways, um, this is going to be a general message. Remember to take what resonates, leave what don't, all right? Today is January the 5th, Friday, okay, 2024, all right? I'm picking up on some good energy here. I feel like somebody could be manifesting something. Yeah, we have the seven of pentacles here. Somebody could be manifesting something new, like a new relationship, new money. Somebody is manifesting something or something that you manifested has come in. We have the justice card here. I feel like you could be getting justice in something in some Thing. This could be some type of legal situation. This could be some type of partnership. This could be some type of relationship. This could be something new. Okay. I feel like you're working on something new or you're doing something. I'm hearing something about manifestations here. Somebody could have tried to block your manifestations. Somebody could have tried to block your work or I don't know, but you're, you receive justice in something. Okay. Libra energy here. You could be a Libra. Okay. Or a double Libra. Okay, you could be any sign here. You could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. Yeah, we have the Moon card here. Confirmation. You could be a Cancer or a Libra. You could be, or a Cancer could be dealing with a Libra, or a Libra could be dealing with a Cancer. Somebody's birthday could be like the eleventh month. Uh, well, I don't, I don't know. Maybe your birthday could be in November, or something is going to take place in November. Maybe you're planning some type of trip or planning some type of outing for November, like next year. I don't know. Maybe you just could could have got promoted to a new position or a new job or I don't know. Somebody's birthday could be on the 18th. So somebody's somebody's birthday could be November the 18th or something like that. I'm hearing 111, 11, 11 could be significant. I don't know. So we'll see. Oh, wow. We have the 10 of Pentacles here. Yeah, somebody is manifesting a lot of money, a lot of abundance. Um, I'm hearing like everything brand new. I feel like somebody is starting their new off, new year off right. Okay. Everything is going well for you. Yeah, nine of Pentacles here in the reverse. I feel like somebody could be hating on your money, your looks, your finances your beauty but you don't really give a fuck you don't care you're doing well you're resting you're rejuvenating you're happy you're self-sufficient abundant you're getting money I feel like somebody could be jealous and envious because you went from the nine of pentacles to the ten of pentacles and they're going down. I feel like somebody is going from the nine, the seven, the eight, the the the, <laughs> the six, the five. Somebody is going all the way down. It's like look at this shit. It's like one person money is, is, is declining and like your money is going up. Somebody is mad about that. Somebody is mad because you're successful and you're getting money. All right. And you're receiving justice in something when it comes to the love, love department, your finances, you're receiving justice. I feel like somebody wants somebody to be sad or be heartbroken or I don't know. Somebody wants you to walk away from something. So I don't know. You could have walked away from this person and they're pissed off about that. I don't know. You guys, we have the eight of cups here in the 10 of wands here. I'll clarify this this more in a minute. We need to go ahead and pray, okay, before I continue this read. All right, you guys. And again, I just hope everybody is doing well. Today is a beautiful day, you guys. All right. Today is definitely a beautiful day. All right. Let's go ahead and pray. All right. Holy Spirit, Holy Angels, Archangel Michael, Archangel Raziel, Archangel Raphael, Archangel Gabriel, Archangel Metatron, I ask you to send your greatest white light and please give me clear and precise messages. Protect my crown chakra, protect my throat chakra, protect my heart chakra, protect me from any harm or entity that does not want me to speak, that does not want me to get messages out. Okay. Somebody could be attending a luncheon or somebody could be going to brunch or somebody could be going to lunch. Somebody could actually be on their lunch break. Like, like, I don't know when you may receive this message, but I'm seeing somebody on their lunch break or somebody could be going like on an outing or somebody could be planning some type of girls trip or some type of guys trip. I'm hearing something about Las Vegas, Las Vegas, Nevada. OK, somebody could be going to the casino. We have the four of swords here in the reverse. I feel like I feel like there is a group of people or one person, possibly up to four to ten people that are being defeated. OK, it's like there is a group of like, I don't know, there is a group of losers. There is a group of karmics that's doing something behind the scenes, manipulating something behind the scenes. I feel like there is a group of individuals that are that's manipulating somebody's money or somebody's finances or they're trying to and they're mad because it's not working. Again, you guys, this is a collective message. So just take what resonates, leave what don't. I don't know if I'm going to hold you guys for a while um, I'm just, or I'm just going to be on here 
excuse me, engine number 444 on the clock, or I'm just going to be on here for a short period of time. Either way it go, just take what resonate, leave what don't. But again, I'm seeing here that there is a group of individuals, possibly up to four to 10 people that's working behind the scenes to try to get somebody to stop doing something or quit something, or somebody is trying to manipulate somebody's money. Somebody is jealous and envious of somebody because it's like they're losing money and you're gaining money. I'm hearing like, yeah, you're gaining, something is gaining momentum. Okay. Yeah. It's like your finances, your love life. I feel like somebody is very successful. It's like you went through from the nine of pentacles to the 10 of pentacles. We have the seven of pentacles here. It's like you've manifested a new life. It's like you've manifested a new beginning and you're doing well for yourself. Divine masculine, divine feminine. You're doing very much. You're doing good. Yeah. We have the seven of staffs here in the reverse. Yeah. I feel like somebody wants, I don't know. I feel like somebody is jealous because I don't know, you could be single, you could be by yourself, or you could be with your person, you could be with your divine counterpart. Somebody could be jealous because they can't get into your relationship or getting your business or I don't know. I'm hearing that song again, me against the world. It's like somebody wants, I don't know, somebody wants somebody to argue with them. Somebody wants somebody to fight with them. Somebody could be projecting onto somebody here. Somebody is projecting their insecurities. Okay, Spear, what the hell is this? Yeah, we have the queen of swords here. Yeah, you could be rejecting somebody's offer or you could be rejecting some type of relationship or some type of partnership. I don't know. I'm just seeing good energy here. And you guys know when I say I don't know a bunch of times, that means I do know. I just see some karmic ass bullshit. It's like the energy that I'm getting from for, for you guys, you're taking off. Yeah, look, eight of staffs here. Somebody is jealous and envious. It's like your funds, your finances are like, uh, you're taking off in, the, in your finances, your love life. You're just taking off at a rapid pace. And it's like somebody else here, it's like they're declining. Everything is declining. And, and yeah, somebody's card could be declining. Yeah. Okay. So I can, yeah, we have the King of Pentacles in the reverse. Yeah. So I don't know. It's one of these losers here, male or female. Somebody is mad because they can't manifest off of you. They can't steal from you. They can't take from you. It's like somebody knows that you're going to be successful. You're going to be rich. You're going to be famous. You're going to be world renowned. Somebody could be a rapper here. Somebody could be a musician. Somebody could definitely be a musician. Somebody could definitely work in the music industry or excuse me, the entertainment industry. Yeah, Ace of Pentacles here. So there is a King of Pentacles here in the reverse that wants this Ace of Pentacles. It's like you're it's like you're skyrocketing. Somebody is literally skyrocketing to the top of excuse me, spiritual bird. Somebody is skyrocketing to the top of the pyramid or something like that. You're taking off at a rapid pace and can't nobody stop you. I'm hearing, ain't no stopping us now. We're on the move. Yeah, Ten of Swords here in the reverse. Death card here in the reverse. Yeah, somebody is trying to Ten of Swords you. They're trying to bring an ending to your foundation. Somebody could be dealing with an Aquarius, okay? Or a Gemini, Libra, or an Aquarius. Yeah, world card here. I feel like somebody is destined to be world-renowned. A world-renowned musician, star, athlete, some Something. Somebody is definitely supposed to do something in the public eye. I'm hearing somebody could be an Aquarius. Somebody could be a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, a Libra, um, a Taurus. Okay, somebody could be any sign. I just seen the three of cups here. You're definitely about to be celebrating something. I'm just seeing a new beginning. And it's like somebody is just stuck. We have the hangman here in the in the reverse. You could be very enlightened. You could be very intuitive. You could have went through a dark night of the soul, a kundalini awakening, uh, possibly even multiple kundalini awakenings. I don't know. It's just somebody is so beautiful here, so handsome. Somebody is very beautiful. Somebody is very abundant. Somebody is just successful. And there is a loser in the background, male or female or a group of people that's hating somebody is just hating yeah ten of cups here in the reverse yes yeah, a bunch of reversals here Okay, this could be your family that's hating on you. This could be some type of secret occult organization. It's just a bunch of haters here. I'm hearing tell me why they hating. I'm hearing Boosie in my head hating on me because I'm trying to get this paid. But yeah, you're getting money. Yeah, congratulations. High Priestess here in the upright. So you could be a Piscean. I don't know. Or a Piscean could be attacking you. It's like any sign could be attacking you. Just take what side you're on. You're, you're either on the good side of karma or you're on the bad side of karma. Okay, one second. Uh, let me get a, some water, you guys. <clears throat> I'm just seeing good things in this energy. Like, dang, this is the first time in a long time I've just gotten some uh, really good energy. One second. It's just a bunch of haters here, okay, that don't want some type of truth to come out or they don't want something to be exposed. I don't know what this is, but it's like, 
for real, y'all. Divine masculine, divine feminine. You guys are getting money. You guys are so like beautiful. You're handsome. If you don't have a lot of money, it's definitely coming in. Somebody knows this. Somebody knows that you're manifesting. It's like, I don't know, are you manifested something? Somebody is pissed off because you're you're taking off and they can't go where you're going. Look, look at this eight of staffs. You're taking off very quickly and they can't go where you're going. They, they can't come. You, they, they're not invited. You don't want them there. Somebody is mad because maybe you don't want them. Maybe you're not interested in them. Somebody could be afraid of to, to approach you. Somebody could be intimidated by you. We have the queen of wands here. Okay. Somebody's ex is pissed off at them. This could be your baby mother, your ex-wife. This could even be a bitch made ass masculine, divine feminine. Somebody is in a queen of wands energy here. Okay, and the Queen of Wands don't necessarily have to be have to be bad, but we have the Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, or somebody can feel like this about you, or I don't know, somebody feels like somebody is very guarded, or somebody feels like somebody is very nonchal nonchalant, or I don't know, somebody is mad because you cut them off and you don't want them, male or female. It's like since you don't want them, since you're not interested in them, they're trying to orchestrate shit behind the scenes and nothing seems to be working because they're a fucking loser. Somebody also wants to sleep with somebody here. We have the ace of staffs here be careful because somebody can have an incurable std okay i keep picking up on some type of um i keep picking up on a man that has a small penis but they also have an incurable std like somebody can have a herpes somebody can have hiv aids somebody can literally be sick or somebody is going to end up in a coma because i don't know somebody could have been diagnosed with some type of incurable std and they won't take the medicine yeah two of cups here in the reverse somebody wants to partner up with you so they can give you an incurable std they're pissed off because you don't have have it you're healthy yeah somebody is mad because you're healthy even if you don't have a lot of money you're you're healthy you're beautiful you're handsome you're healthy it doesn't matter you're just abundant i'm seeing nothing but abundance here i'm seeing an overflow of abundance and i'm seeing like a lot of blue i'm seeing a lot of purple it's like things things are just like going really smooth in your life somebody is mad somebody is trying to bring chaos to you because you don't have any problems you're not sick you don't have an incurable std you don't have a gravely ill disease you're not on drugs you're not on alcohol you're handsome you're beautiful you're sexy you're smart you're intelligent okay i don't know you could be a libra you could be a cancer pisces scorpio you could be a taurus you're just abundant i feel like somebody is, is is like i don't know it's like you're flying off the hinges i feel like this reading is for chosen ones look look judgment card here look at this look it's like somebody has like i mean the most high god okay well yeah i'm gonna say that too somebody angel number 12 22 on the clock somebody is trying to play god in your life but the most high god is calling judgment on this person or these people yeah somebody is mad because they're in the five of pentacles and it's like you're you're taking off somebody is mad because you're taking off at a rapid pace i keep hearing someone is flying off the hinges it's like i'm hearing uh, enough of the smoke screens it's like somebody was trying to put up some type some type of illusion spirit slow down the downloads <laughs> i know i'm probably talking fast you guys i'm just getting download after download after download but it's like this ex lover here lover's card in the reverse of five of swords here it's like somebody here was trying to keep up some type of illusion or put up some type of smoke smoke screen somebody wants you to see them for somebody that they're not i feel like somebody is trying to come in like an emperor somebody is trying to come in like like the empress and they're a fucking loser they're a snake they're a con this is somebody that wants to finesse you break you down sleep with you give you some type of incurable std or whatever the fuck uh tower card here yeah there's definitely about to be a tower i feel like somebody is about to get there get a breakthrough it's like you can literally be in the nine of pentacles and you're going to go from the ten of pentacles to the ace of pentacles somebody is about to get some type of breakthrough somebody is literally you know what i'm hearing somebody is trying to call somebody to have a delay period i don't know what this is or who this is or whatever this could be a group of people that's doing this to somebody, or this could be one person, or this, or, or this could even be a couple or two people that's doing this together. I don't know. Just take what resonates, leave what don't. This is somebody. This is a coworker, a family member, or ex friend. It's like somebody is intentionally trying to cause a delay. Somebody could have looked into a birth chart. Somebody could have looked into. Somebody could be reading somebody's horoscope. Somebody may read somebody's horoscope. Dang, I ain't seen no horoscope in a long time, but somebody could read somebody's horoscope. It's like somebody may read your horoscope in their horoscope or somebody is, or, or, oh wow, or somebody is trying to destiny swap with somebody here. 
Okay. <clears throat> I'm going to pick up these cards. Yeah, three of pentacles here. Yeah, somebody is also working in cahoots. They're always working in cahoots, right? It's like somebody is trying to destiny swap with somebody. Somebody is trying to play God in somebody's life. But the most high God, the real God, the real alpha in the omega has called judgment on this. It's like somebody is literally broke. Either this person is spiritually broke or they're physical broke. I just, I keep hearing that somebody tried to cash a check that they couldn't cash. It's a bunch of these people here that thought that they were going to have like a, an amazing year all 2024. No, somebody thought that they were going to manifest off of you, take your energy and have a life of abundance. I feel like you're taking off so fast. I feel like this reading is for the chosen ones, the 144,000 that has a ticket to the land of milk and honey. It really ain't even shit left, left else to say. This is beautiful. This is like beautiful ass energy right here. Some of you could be traveling. Some of you could be traveling overseas. You could be planning to do this or I don't know. Somebody may be trying to come in to bribe somebody like, look, 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 be real, real careful. Be real, real careful. Divine masculine, divine feminine of people trying to come in to bribe you or uh, I don't know. Somebody may try to take somebody on a vacation or, or a trip or somebody may try to buy somebody something like some type of material item in possession. Be careful because somebody is a con. Somebody is a con. This king of pentacles in the reverse that's going broke. I feel like there is a king of pentacles here in the reverse that you could have cut off you could have blocked okay uh, queen of swords here or there there is a queen of wands in the reverse there's somebody here that's low vibrational as fuck somebody is a con somebody is trying to finesse somebody okay because they're broke they're going broke it's like somebody could have had a lot of money at one point somebody could have been stealing your energy or something like that to manifest a life of abundance and they've been blocked somebody is blocked from doing this and so since they're blocked from stealing or taking your energy, now they're trying to come in and finesse you. Somebody wants to take you on a vacation. Somebody wants to take you on the trip on a trip or somebody want to take you around the world or, or around a merry-go-round. Somebody wants to play mind games with you. Somebody wants to sleep with you. And this could be male or female. Somebody wants to play you or somebody wants to apologize to you for something that they did in the past. Or I don't know. Somebody wants to make something up to somebody. Somebody wants to reconcile with somebody. This empress in the reverse or I don't know, male or female email Okay, or you could be an empress, or you could be a uh, 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 you could be an emperor or empress. <laughs> One second, y'all. <clears throat> Excuse me. Yeah, I feel like somebody here is just trying to cause an injustice for somebody. Somebody is trying to finesse somebody out their panties, out their drawers. I don't fucking know. Somebody is planning to do something or whatever the fuck this is. Let me pick up this deck. I'm gonna get another deck, you guys. Somebody is destined, I mean, somebody is uh, definitely destined to be in the public eye. Somebody is a world-renowned star. Somebody is trying to block somebody. Somebody is intentionally trying to cause somebody to have a delay. Look, be very careful. I don't know what to tell you, divine masculine, divine feminine. Trust your intuition. Be very careful. Somebody is planning on finessing somebody. Somebody is going to reach out to somebody and ask somebody, do they want to go on a date or do they want to go on a trip? Or uh, Money can't buy love. I don't know who needs to hear this, but if somebody don't fucking want you, they don't fucking want you. Okay, if you want this person you want this person if you do you do i don't know but somebody wants to reconcile with somebody if this is not a romantic partnership or a relationship this could even be a family member here yeah with the seven of pentacles here i'm telling you whoever this king of pentacles is somebody can't manifest anything it's like you went it's like whoever this is they're going down Somebody is going down or somebody could even be, somebody's going to be arrested. Somebody could even be in jail or they're going to jail. Okay. Or somebody is facing jail time. Somebody may want you to hold them down while they're in jail or they're in prison, male or female. Somebody is going to jail for something. Somebody is going to the feds. I don't fucking know. Somebody may, somebody could be in jail. Somebody may reach out to you uh, from a jail cell. Somebody may call you from collect or something like that. Or somebody could be paying somebody to reach out to you or do something to you. I don't know what the fuck this is. I'm just here and be careful because some Somebody is desperate. Somebody is desperate for money. Somebody is desperate for energy. Somebody is desperate for sex. Somebody will take anything. I feel like whoever you are, you got like a lot of good energy. Somebody or, or I don't know, you've manifested something new. I feel like this reading is for the chosen ones. It's like you guys have manifested something new, a new beginning, a new life. And this person is trying to cause a delay. It's like, I don't know. Somebody is literally trying to block your blessings because they can't manifest shit because they broke as fuck. And they're in the five of pentacles. I feel like this is a con. This is a con artist. Artist, excuse me. 
This is a con artist. This is a gold digger. This is an opportunist. This is somebody here that don't even like you, don't even love you, don't even want you. This is somebody here that wants to use you for your energy, use you for your time, use you for your money. I'm hearing energy and money. Somebody wants to use you. Even if you don't have a lot of money, somebody wants to manifest off of you because they're going broke. This king of pentacles in the reverse, they can't manifest shit. It's like you could have went from the nine of pentacles to the 10 of pentacles and you're headed to the ace of pentacles and this bitch ass nigga or this man or this woman or whoever the fuck this karmic is somebody is trying to block you somebody is trying to cause a delay and they're doing this on purpose somebody could be doing a love spell somebody could be doing a black magic candle magic picture magic beauty magic somebody is intentionally trying to cause you to have a delay because they see that you're taking off at a rapid pace period look ace of cups here i told you i can't make this up you're about to receive some type of major blessing and somebody wants to be a part of this i feel like this could be you know what yeah this could be somebody that betrayed you or rejected you in the past. This is somebody that acted like they wasn't interested in you or they didn't want you. This is somebody that could have possibly ghosted you. Now they want to reconcile because they see that you're doing well. Don't fall for this shit. Somebody is a con artist. Whoever this is, you're a fucking loser and a con artist. For real. Somebody is definitely, somebody could, I don't know, somebody, I feel like somebody has money, but they don't have that much money. I don't know. Even if this person does have money, I feel like somebody is a warlock or a dark witch. Somebody has a, a, a demon attached to them or somebody could actually be a demon or somebody is actually not even a human. Somebody can literally be like a, a, a reptilian or a warlock. Somebody is not human. I'm telling you, somebody is planning on bribing somebody. Even if this person has a lot of money, somebody could be a criminal. Somebody can make their money the illegal way. It's like somebody is planning on coming in, giving somebody a bag, like a purse, some shoes, a, a house, a car. Somebody is planning on doing something. I don't know what this is. Just be real careful. I feel like this is a man or a woman. Yeah, I just see. Look, I told you devil card here. Somebody is a warlock or a dark witch. I feel like somebody wants to finesse somebody. Somebody wants to get somebody in the bed. Somebody wants to take somebody on a trip. Somebody want, I'm hearing I'm hearing something about like a merry-go-round. It's like somebody wants to sleep with somebody. Somebody wants to slip, uh, 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 set somebody up. I'm hearing as well. So it's like somebody is trying to finesse somebody. I, I don't know what this is. Just be real careful because somebody is a con artist, like period. Let me get another deck here. Yeah, we have the search here. We have the search, feeling lost, confused, and lonely. It's like somebody wants somebody to be like a captain save a hoe. I don't know. So male or female, somebody wants to come in like they've changed, like they love you, like they like you. I'm actually hearing somebody say like, where you been? I haven't heard from you. You ghosted me. Somebody wants to come in and be like, oh, I've changed. I miss you. I love you. Can we work it out? I feel like this is a loser. This is a loser in a con. This could even be somebody, I'm serious, serious, seriously, you guys, this could be somebody that's a reptilian. This person is not even human. I don't know. Somebody is a demon or they have a lot of demons attached to them. Somebody also has a lot of baggage. Somebody has like a lot of baby mama drama or baby daddy drama. Somebody has a lot of shit attached to them. Somebody is a fucking loser, period. Be real careful. If this person could be married. Somebody could be secretly married. If this person doesn't have children, they, they're married. Okay. Or they have, uh, I don't know. I don't know. Somebody has a lot of baggage, emotional baggage. Somebody has a lot of trauma. Somebody needs to heal. Somebody has a lot of childhood wounds that they need to go heal. Okay. Or somebody could be saying this shit about you. Okay. If you're resonating with this, put this in the comment section. I don't know who needs to hear this. Okay. But this is the energy that I'm picking up on. If a man or a woman don't want you, they don't want you. If somebody is single, allow them to be single. If somebody is in a relationship and they don't want you in their business, that's their fucking business. If somebody but reject you, if somebody don't like you, that don't mean that they're guarded. That don't mean that they're hurt. That don't mean that they're uh, sad. That don't mean that they're depressed. That don't mean that they're lonely. That means they don't want to fucking talk to you. That means they don't like you. They don't love you. They don't want you. I feel like somebody is delusional here. Whoever this is in this energy, male or female, somebody is delusional. Somebody is trying to cause a delay. It's like somebody knows that you're not interested in them. Somebody knows that you don't want them. You don't like them. You don't want to talk to them. So they're intentionally doing some type of love spell or some type of black magic to try to cause you a delay. But listen, though, here's the catch 22. They're not doing this shit because they really like you and they're interested in you and they want you. They're doing this shit because they're broke as fuck because they can't manifest anything. This could definitely be somebody that, that ghosted you or could have lost you 
or took you for granted in the past. Now they're broke as fuck. Somebody could have chose a third party over you. It's like somebody has a lot of bills. Somebody has a lot of finances. Somebody has a lot of responsibilities and they want you to get out of this shit. Who the fuck? Hold the fuck up. Hold the fuck up. Let me get another dick. Hold up. Yeah, we have nine of hearts here. Fulfillment, harmony, and protection. You're protected from this, okay? By your spirit guides, your ancestors. Hold up, y'all. I got to get another dick. Hold up. Are you crazy? Somebody is crazy here. I feel like somebody is going up against a chosen one. Yeah, three of cups here. It's like somebody doesn't want somebody celebrating. Somebody doesn't want somebody to be happy, to be blessed, because I don't know. Somebody is literally trying to destiny swap with somebody. Somebody wants your life. This could be a man that wants to be a woman or a woman that wants to be a be a man, or this could even be some same sex here. Uh, Spirit, tell me some more that's going on here. Somebody is a loser. Look, the five of pentacles came out again. Look, we have the five of pentacles. This king of wands here, king of pentacles in the reverse nine of swords here is desperate i don't care if this is a man or a woman but i feel like this is a man this is a karmic ass masculine that could be doing this to a divine feminine or this is a karmic feminine that's doing this to a divine masculine this could definitely be your ex or this could definitely be somebody from your past i don't know with the knight of swords here somebody plan on rushing in it's like somebody plans on rushing in saying, I love you. I like you. I miss you. I'm sorry. I ghosted you. Can we reconcile? Can I take you out on a date? Can I take you on a trip? Can I take you around the world? Yeah. Somebody has bad intentions. This is a fucking con artist. Somebody has a lot of bills. Somebody has a lot of responsibilities. I feel like somebody got so much shit. Somebody wants to manifest off of somebody. I feel like somebody, I don't know. I don't know what the fuck this is. Somebody is a con. Somebody is a con period. A con and a loser. They can't manifest shit. So they want to manifest off of you. This is somebody that also could be very materialistic. I don't know. I don't know why I keep hearing this, but money can't buy love. Whoever you are, male or female, you can't buy this man or this woman. I feel like somebody is trying to buy an empress or an emperor. Somebody is trying to buy somebody or take somebody somewhere. And I feel like you're not interested. You could have even told this person, I'm not interested in you. I don't fucking want you. I don't care if you're a millionaire, a billionaire. I don't know what people think, but don't nobody give a fuck about y'all money. These karmic ass masculines out here, especially. It's a lot of these karmic ass masculines. You think because you got money that you can just buy any woman. You can't buy a, div a divine feminine. I don't know. Somebody is fucking delusional here. Somebody is a delusional fuck. Whoever you are, you're a fucking delusional. Male or female, you're delusional. Yeah, we have the search here. Feeling lost, confused, and lonely. Somebody feels like because somebody is single, somebody thinks you're single, or somebody doesn't know if you're in a relationship or not. Somebody feels like because you're not with somebody, or I don't know, somebody feels like their spell work is working, and it's not. Somebody feels like they're blocking somebody's love life and they're not. Somebody is intentionally doing this. Somebody is doing a love spell. If this is not a romantic partner, this could be anything. Somebody is intentionally trying to cause somebody delays on purpose so they can come in and, and act like they're saving the day. I don't know. I'm hearing somebody wants to spoil somebody with a bunch of gifts. I don't know. I'm seeing T.I. and Tiny in my head. And you know how every time T.I. and Tiny used to get into an argument, T.I. would go buy her a car or buy. I, I don't know. I feel like you're a divine feminine. You're not a queen of wands or you're a divine masculine. You're not a king of wands. You're a whole fucking emperor or empress out here. Somebody feels like they can buy your love. And I feel like this is somebody that's broke. Somebody, somebody is on borrowed time and borrowed money. So I feel like somebody needs to go pay the piper. That's what I'm hearing. I feel like somebody is the devil finna collect somebody ass. That's what it is. It's like somebody could have put you up for a sacrifice and now they're scared because the devil finna fucking collect they ass. So now they need you. I'm telling you, be real careful of people trying to come back from the past. Okay. Cause these motherfuckers are desperate to get to the land of milk and honey. Be real careful of people trying to come back from the past, trying to reconcile, trying to buy you gifts or take you out on a trip or a date or whatever the fuck. Be real careful. I'm hearing something about a movie date. Somebody is trying to sweep some Somebody off their feet. I feel like this is somebody that's trying to come in and sweep somebody off their feet and finesse them. Okay, because they're scared. Somebody, somebody owed the devil. Somebody owed Papa Labor. Somebody owed the devil. Somebody could have literally put somebody up as a sacrifice. And they're they're losing everything. They're going broke. Somebody can actually have money, but it's like their money is declining and you're taking off at a rapid pace. Somebody is intentionally trying to cause you some type of delay. This is somebody that will come in. This could be somebody that ghosted you. OK, this is somebody that will come in and fuck you, sleep with you, spoil you, buy you shit and then finesse you. This is the type of person that you will never hear from again. This is a fucking loser and a con. Whoever you are, you're a loser. You're a con, a con and you're you're a retard, period. What else is here, spirit? 
Is there anything else, Spirit, before I close this message out? Yeah, we have the sun card here. Yeah, yeah, I feel like you're happy. I feel like you're somewhere happy. You're abundant. Look, three of pentacles here. I feel like, I mean, three of cups here. I feel like you're about to be celebrating or you're celebrating. You're celebrating your wins. You're celebrating your future. You're celebrating your outcome. Whoever, I don't know who this is or what this is. Whoever you are, you're a loser. Somebody is intentionally trying to cause somebody a delay. Somebody is doing something behind the scenes. Somebody is orchestrating something. Somebody is planning something. Somebody could be trying to plan some type of trip or some type of outing or some type of date. I don't know. Maybe you can know about this or maybe you do. You could have possibly told this person, look, bitch, I don't want to go out on a date with you. I don't care how much money you got. I don't like you. I don't love you. I don't care how, how big your penis is, how wet your vagina gets, uh, get, bitch. I'm not interested. You could have literally told somebody I'm not fucking interested and this person is delusional or maybe you didn't even tell this person that somebody is literally I don't know what's wrong with these people. These people are weird. It's like, I don't know. You can't get money. Can't buy love. I, I don't know. And it's like some of these people are so fucking delusional. They feel like if somebody's single that they're lonely or something. Cause look, I'm looking at this card and it says the search feeling lost, confused, and lonely. Some people feel like because people are single, they're lonely or somebody or some, or some, uh, excuse me. Sometimes people feel like if somebody is, is, is like by their self, that they're not in a relationship or something like that. Somebody feels like somebody doesn't have options because they're by themselves or I don't fucking know what this is. Ace of, Ace of Wands here. Be very careful because somebody may try to get pregnant by you or somebody may want to get pregnant by you. All right. Or something like that. Look, I told you, look, page of, page of cups here in the reverse. Y'all bear with me. I know my words. My words start getting discombobulated <laughs> when I start getting a bunch of goddamn downloads. Yeah, this king of pentacles in the reverse yeah somebody is I, I don't know look the king of pentacles is coming out twice it's like somebody is trying to do a love spell somebody is trying to manifest somebody somebody is trying to bring somebody in i don't know somebody is a loser and they're blocked two of swords here somebody is blocked or you need to block this person somebody may try to reach out to you on social media somebody may send you a dm or a text message i don't know who the fuck you are Whoever this is in this energy, I'm going to break something all the way down. I don't like this energy. This energy is karmic as fuck. Somebody is a con. Whoever you are, you're a con artist and a fucking loser, period. And somebody is delusional and somebody is retarded. Somebody is missing brain cells. Somebody is a retarded fuck. I don't care if this is a man or a woman. Just because somebody is single or just because somebody is in a relationship on a low don't mean that they got to be with you. Don't mean that they have to talk to you or deal with you. Somebody is literally trying to cause somebody a delay because they're money hungry. Somebody can't manifest shit and somebody owed the devil a soul. No, the devil going to collect your motherfucking ass. I feel like the devil finna collect somebody. Somebody finna go to jail or they're going to pass the fuck away. I feel like somebody could have put somebody up as a sacrifice. Somebody is a loser. Yeah, this is a warlock or a dark witch here that's trying to finesse somebody. And somebody is planning something behind the scenes. How you going to plan a vacation or how you going to plan an outing or a date or, or a comeback? I'm hearing a major setback for a major comeback. It's like somebody could have ghosted somebody in the past. Somebody could have, somebody is a snake. Somebody is a snake and a con artist. I don't know, male or female, somebody betrayed you. Somebody could have had a baby on you or I don't fucking know. Or you could, or, or, or you, I don't know. I don't know. Either this is you or this is somebody else. Somebody could have had a baby on you or somebody could have got somebody pregnant or I don't know. Somebody could have chose a third party over you and somebody is, somebody is losing everything. This is the year of redemption. This is the year of truth, truth, excuse me. This is karmic justice here. One second. Somebody is literally planning on finessing somebody. It's like, even if somebody's intentions are good, I don't understand why people do shit like this. And, I, and I'm sick of these, especially these masculines. I'm sick of these karmic ass masculines that think because they got money that they can buy any woman. Every woman don't want your money. You can't buy every woman. Okay, you can't buy every divine feminine. You can't even do that for divine masculine anyways. Number one, you can't do it to divine masculine because he's a real man, but you, you can't do it to a divine feminine either. It's like somebody could literally be like, I don't know, somebody could have really changed. Somebody could have really, somebody could really want to reconcile with somebody. And it's like, I don't know, somebody feels like because somebody is single. Look, again, we have the search, feeling lost, confused, lonely. Somebody feels like because somebody is single or somebody is by themselves that they're lost or they're, they're confused, they're lonely. Somebody really feels like their money is everything. And I feel like this person don't even got no fucking money. I feel like if they do got money, they got very little. Somebody has a lot of responsibility. Somebody has a lot of bills. Somebody may take care of their whole family so somebody's whole family could be involved in this shit 
Somebody is literally trying to come towards a divine masculine, divine feminine so they can get so they can get out of the gutter, so they can get out of the hole. Somebody may have to move back to the hood. Somebody could have been living in the suburbs. Now they got to move back to the hood. Now they got to move back to the ghetto. Somebody think they're going to come in and sex you down, get you some vagina, get you some penis and steal from you and take from you. No, I'm sick of these fucking karmics. Yeah. And again, just because money don't buy love, especially if a motherfucker don't want you. You can't make a man or woman want you. And then and then on top of that, you got the nerve to be doing love spells. You got the nerve to be doing spell work to try to cause somebody to have a delay. And they're still self-sufficient of money. You, they still getting money. Divine masculine, divine feminine is still getting money. No, bitch. He not finna get you pregnant and you not finna get this woman pregnant. No. I feel like somebody is trying to... I, I'm t- I've been picking up on this shit. I don't know how long. Somebody, somebody is literally trying to manifest a life of abundance for themselves, their family, their children. I don't fucking know. I don't know what's wrong with these fucking karmics trying to manifest off of people and then destiny swap as well you're blocked you're blocked as fuck period yeah look at this we have the will of fortune in the reverse i feel like somebody is losing everything if they're not physically losing shit i feel like somebody keeps trying to i keep hearing this i don't know why i keep hearing this but somebody keeps trying to cash a check they can't cash it's like somebody really thought that they were gonna have like a this extravagant gear off of your energy I don't know, bro. I'm just tired of picking up on this shit. Yeah, ma magician card here. Somebody really thought that they were going to manifest a life of abundance off of you. Yeah, magician card. Yeah, you see this snake up here? I feel like this could even be a reptilian. Somebody not human, man. I don't know. This is a reptilian or a warlock or a dark witch with the devil card here and the magician. Somebody is literally trying to block your, your life. Your destiny. Somebody is trying to play God in your life. And I don't understand what's wrong with these people. Some of these people really do be sincere. Some of these people really do want to apologize and reconcile with people, but they, they intentions ain't right. It's like a lot of people don't understand when it comes to the love department. If the spiritual court voids a contract, it's over, bitch. You're not going to unvoid the contract. If God, un uh, if God voids a fucking contract, whether that's a romantic partnership, a partnership in business, family, it don't matter if, it, if it's your friends, your family, your ex lover. If God voids a contract, it's over. It's like somebody wants a do over. Somebody wants a second chance. And because you won't give them a second chance, because you don't want to reconcile with them, because you don't like them, because you don't want them in your life, because you don't want to work with them, partner up with them, because you don't want to be with them, talk to them, whatever the fuck this is, because you don't want to do that. Somebody feels like uh, they, they can do a love spell or they can block you. They can cause delays in your life. Somebody is a fucking loser and a con. Whoever you are, you're a con and a retard and a cokehead. Somebody is a cokehead too. Somebody is a cokehead. Somebody is a drunk. Ace of Pentacles here. And somebody is also very materialistic. It's like somebody only wants to come towards somebody because I don't know. It's like even if this person, male or female, even if this person has good intentions, even if somebody really wants to spoil somebody, take care of somebody, even if somebody wants to really be a good mother, be a good wife, be a good husband, be a good boyfriend, even if somebody really wants to do that, it's over. I feel like this is a relationship that's over. Okay? Okay. Now, again, this don't have to be a romantic partnership, even though I'm seeing that this could be like somebody that, that, that you don't want to work with no more. Or this could be some type of this could be a family member or something that you don't want to deal with no more. Whatever the hell this is, I feel like it's over. The contract has been voided. Somebody wants a, a do over in your life. Some This is somebody from your past that wants to come back and reconcile after they did you dirty, after they did you wrong. Somebody is a snake. Once a snake, they're always a snake. And I feel like if this person had the opportunity, they'll snake you again. This is the type of person that will come in, sleep with you, love bomb you and get energy off of you, money off of you, time off of you and give it to their family, give it to, to their children. Somebody could even be married in this situation. If this person is not married, somebody is just they're, they're, they're just a fucking snake. Somebody is a snake. Somebody is literally trying to finesse somebody and somebody is slow. So like divine masculine, divine feminine, you're self-sufficient, abundant. OK, you could be in a relationship or you're single, but either way it go, you're self-sufficient and abundant. It's like somebody feels like because you're by yourself or somebody feels like because you're low key, this could even be somebody that's stalking and watching you, gang stalking you with a group of people, three of cups here. Somebody feels like because you're by yourself, somebody feels like they know you. I don't fucking know. This person could have knew you in the past, but you've changed. You've grown. You've evolved. This person don't even fucking know you. This is a weirdo. Somebody is a delusional fuck and a weirdo. 
I don't know who you are, but you a weirdo. Look, look, lover's card here in the reverse. Somebody is definitely, this could definitely be an ex-lover. I'm telling you, that could have ghosted you or I don't know. Somebody wants to reconcile. Somebody feels like they know somebody because they sit behind the scenes and watch you. And I feel like somebody don't even know you at all. Somebody is a loser. Somebody feels like they know what you like. Somebody feels like they know what you don't like. Somebody is weird. I'm tired of picking up on these stalkers and a lot of this shit be karmic ass masculines and shit that's stalking divine feminines. A lot of these people think because they got money that nobody don't give a fuck about your money, bitch. Nobody gives a fuck about your money but you and the people you hang around. Somebody literally thinks if they take somebody on a trip or they take somebody on a vacation or if they take somebody on an outing that they're going to just, you're just, just going to fall in love. And I don't fucking know what the fuck this is, bitch. I don't know what this is. I'm so tired of picking up on these weird ass readings because y'all, <laughs> for real, when I'm not on camera, I just be so cool, calm and collected. And then when I get on here, I'll be like, what the fuck is this? These people are weird. It's like some, and somebody actually thinks their spell work is working. Yeah, if I do this candle magic, if I do this picture magic, if I do this beauty magic, then I'm going to cause delays in divine masculine, divine feminine's life. They're never going to get buried. They're never going to have love unless they're with me. That's my divine masculine. That's my divine feminine. I'm hearing, I'm hearing there is a contract that has been voided. Whether this is a romantic partnership, somebody wants a do over in your life. Seriously, this is somebody in your past that wants a do over. And, I, and I'm going to say this again for the 50th, 50th million time. Money can't buy love. If somebody don't want you, they don't fucking want you, period. You can't make nobody fucking want you, especially somebody. Yeah, you know, I feel like as human beings, we're supposed to forgive people, but that's it. That's all. It's like somebody wants you to forgive them and then get back into a relationship with them after they betrayed you, after they snaked you. Once a snake, they're always a snake. Somebody wants you to work with them again. Somebody want to do business with you again after they snaked you. No, you can forgive somebody and move on with your life. You don't have to forgive somebody and be in a relationship. And since you don't want to work with this person anymore, since you don't want to do business with this person since you don't want to be in a relationship they're trying to cause you delays on purpose and i feel like this is somebody that's intimidated by you or scared of you somebody is a fucking con a con and a loser and a cokehead i'm picking up somebody is on coke okay somebody is a crackhead i'll call it that yeah you might be snorting coke but you're a fucking crackhead and a drunk and a retard somebody like brown liquor here somebody like hennessy cavassier or some shit like that somebody like brown liquor i don't know somebody is a drunk and a skunk somebody funkiest somebody don't i don't know somebody don't take baths or i don't know somebody's just a fucking loser i don't know what this is or maybe this person do take baths they're dirty this person's uh, energy is dirty. This this person's energy is stank. This is a so stank ass bitch or a stank ass nigga. I don't know what this is. Again, it's different for everybody. This could be a family member. This could be an ex lover. This could be anybody that's trying to cause you delays. And it's like somebody is projecting on somebody too. It's like somebody sees that you're self-sufficient, abundant on your own, or you can low-key be in a relationship and they don't know about it or whatever the fuck. Somebody sees that you're stable and somebody wants to ruin that for you. Somebody is pissed off and angry because you're stable. And so since you don't want to reconcile with them, since you don't want to partner up with them, then you're lost. You're, somebody feels like, I don't know. Somebody literally has a God complex. Somebody thinks that they're God. Somebody thinks that they can just come in and, 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 and I, I don't know. I, I don't know what the fuck this is. I really don't. It's like, tell me something. Put this in the comment section. Like, tell me something. It's like, if 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 you see a man or a woman that's by themselves and they're happy, leave them the fuck alone. If you see a man or a woman that's in a relationship, leave them the fuck alone. But these people don't know how to do that. These people fuck their whole life up. These are the people that I keep picking up on that forfeited their destiny. They want to redo. Somebody wants to re a redo in your life. Somebody wants to be your friend again. This could be an ex best friend or something like that that snaked you. It's a bunch of snakes here. They want to redo. No, you're a fucking snake. Even if divine masculine, divine feminine uh, forgave you, you're a fucking snake. Once a snake, always a snake. And I feel like these people are money hungry. They're materialistic. They only want a second chance. Somebody thinks you're weak because you're by yourself or you're, or you're low key. Somebody feels like they know you because they watch you online or they watch you on social media or in real life. I keep picking up on these people. They keep stalking people and gang stalking people. No, bitch. You don't know divine masculine, divine feminine because you watch them online or you follow them in their community. You don't know people.
I feel like somebody feels like because they know somebody who knows somebody, they know you that they know you know, bitch. I don't know what the fuck this is. This is annoying. Whoever these people are, male or female, you're a bunch of weirdos. You're not going to get a re-over. You're not going to get a re-over. You're not going to get a redo. The contract has been voided. Divine masculine don't want you, bitch. He not getting you pregnant. The y'all not getting y'all family together. Divine feminine don't want you if she got children with you. Or whatever the fuck this is. They not. I don't know what the fuck this is. They not working with you. Whatever the fuck. I don't know. What else is here, spirit? I'm just tired of picking up on this karmic ass energy. This shit come out every other fucking day. It's like, can I get something else? I'd be like, damn, as soon as I think a reading is going to start off good, some other shit come out, some other bullshit. These people are weird. You're not going to get a redo. The contract has been voided. You're never going to get to work with divine masculine, divine feminine again. You snake them. You're never going to be in a relationship or a partnership with them. You snake them. If you snake somebody, allow divine masculine, divine feminine to forgive you and go on with your life. Move the fuck on. You're a con. And somebody also has a lot of bills and a lot of responsibilities. Somebody could take care of their whole family. I don't know. Somebody is planning some type of vacation or some type or somebody is planning some type of trip, like a surprise trip or a surprise vacation. Somebody wants to sweep somebody off of their feet again. Even if this person is a good person, you don't have to be with this person. Somebody needs to, I don't know. Somebody also feels like because they changed that they've changed and they've grown and they've evolved that you're supposed to accept them back. Okay. Go change for the next motherfucker. How you going to snake divine masculine, divine feminine and expect them to get back into a relationship with you or a partnership with you because you changed good. If you changed, go be with somebody else, bitch. I don't know what this is. This is annoying. Anything else here, spirit? I'm going to close this out. Yeah, there's about to be some type of completion. Somebody is about to be right, wiped out. If this is a romantic partner or something like that, you're going to end up partnering up with somebody else. Somebody could be trying to block you. Somebody may actually know that you don't want them. OK, or somebody may think that you want them. Somebody is a delusional. Whoever you are, I don't care for real. And I'm gone after this. Whoever you are, you're a con. You're a retard. You're a con. You're retarded. You cock out of you. Sloop, you slew footed. You slow. You look like an orangutan, a, a silverback, a linebacker. I don't know. Somebody is ugly as fuck. OK, this could also I'm also picking up on the gross sisters. This could be a group of women or a group of men that's attacking divine masculine, divine feminine. All of these people are ugly and I don't like to call people ugly, but I feel like all of these people in it. Make sure y'all hit the like, buddy. I feel like all of these people in this situation ship or whatever. The, I, I don't know what this is. Just, this is a bunch of losers here. They, they want to redo. They want to start over. They want something brand new. That's never going to fucking happen. Divine masculine, divine feminine, feminine. Keep moving forward. Keep moving forward. OK, because look, with the three of cups here you're about to be celebrating there is a lot of abundance here a lot of great fortune here nobody you're not going to be able to cause delays for nobody again i feel like it's a group of men or a group of women that could be a this could be an occult as well i'm picking up on a whole nother storyline that i'm not even finna talk about i don't know whoever you are you need to move on whoever you are whatever this is a business relationship a romantic partnership the contract has been voided they don't want to do business with you no more they don't want to be in the nut move on Move and some somebody for I can't even get out of this energy. I can never get out of this energy. But what I'm hearing, somebody is delusional. Somebody is delusional as fuck. Male or female. Somebody feels like because they watch somebody behind the scenes or follow somebody in their community or neighborhood that they know them. They know what they need. They know what they want. Bitch, money can't buy love. OK, you can't buy a divine masculine or a divine feminine. It, it, it especially be these divine masculines that be trying to buy divine feminines just because somebody don't want you or just because somebody don't want to be with you. Don't mean that they're, they're they're lonely. Don't mean that they're confused. Don't mean I don't know what the, I, I got to go. I'm not going to read this karmic ass shit. Uh, 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 divine masculine, divine feminine. It, it's so many blessings here. Keep moving forward. Whoever these people are, whatever the fuck this person is, the, this, this is a this is a con. Somebody is a con in a snake snake once a snake always a snake and somebody is a retard somebody is missing screws somebody is like homer j simpson or Sideshow bob or some shit like that somebody is missing a crayon or somebody got a crayon st stuck up their damn nose somebody is a retard period point blank and if anybody is helping this person somebody's friends or family could be helping this person or a spiritual practitioner somebody could be helping somebody reconcile with somebody and, and i don't know somebody is planning something for somebody I don't know what this is. Somebody going to get rejected. If, if this person hasn't already approached you, they're going to get rejected. OK, if, if they've already approached you, they're mad because you rejected them. I don't know. I don't know what this is, but uh, stay away from this person, because if not, you ain't going to have shit. 
This is somebody that could even be controlling or abusive. Somebody is a fucking weird weirdo here, male or female. Somebody is like Ike Turner from from uh, What's Love Got to Do with It. I don't know. I, I gotta go. Bye. I, I, I don't want to be in this energy. Y'all have a blessed day. This is pathetic. Okay. Somebody is a con artist and a loser that's intentionally trying to cause delays. Period. All right. Peace.